feel it. Do you need a ride us later? Well, it's just a few blocks, two blocks from here. And uh, I think this is tremendous important because uh, if he's successful, that would be fantastic. Uh, then they would be able to make blind people see again. I first was in Toronto because I could not get a visa for the United States because I didn't have anybody to sponsor me. I wanted to go to California and I said to myself, whatever I can get a good deal on an apartment building, that's where I'm going to move to. And so I had a good deal on a building in Sacramento. And I, I don't like to work for somebody else. I like to work for myself. So I, I was looking for something I can be independent, and then I decided to buy apartment buildings. I had Kalkoba for several years, and then my I started to get infection. The eye doctor, he didn't know really what to do because he couldn't, he didn't want to take me off the eye drops. Dr. Lim decided to operate it because my eye pressure was about 35. Since she operated it about five years ago, my eye pressure is just fantastic low. Ernest Channon is a man who understands how fortunate he's been in life and he wants to turn that good fortune into something for others. Whenever we're together, the conversation always turns to what he can do to help people regain vision. I remember the first time I met him at that luncheon um, with his friend. It was really a great luncheon. Um, one, it was very healthy. We ate lots and lots of vegetables that day. I didn't have to touch one for another week. Um, and I learned how important many things were to him. You know, good people, helping others, and how sincere he was inside. Mr. Channon, we have a resolution that says, now therefore be it resolved that the mayor and council of the city of Sacramento we do hereby recognize and honor your achievements and the impact that you've made in our community, and we proclaim February 16th as Ernest E. Channon Day in the city of Sacramento. One more round of applause. <laughs> Just one big happy birthday to Ernest on three. One, two, three. Happy birthday! With a gift such as the one that, that Ernest has given us, to get this project started, uh, I, I think it will really catalyze this work so that uh, optic nerve regeneration, repair of the optic nerve will truly be revolutionized. They will cross that final barrier and learn how to reconnect individual nerves in the eye to restore vision. I want to have a little more land where I can have fruit trees, so I I bought this place here in Orange Well, here, where I'm still here. I have uh, a lot of fruit trees here. That's where I intend to stay, you know.